solve the literal equation. So we have W equals P times V2 minus V1, and we're trying to solve for V2. Let's go ahead and work through it. Solution. So V2 is kind of like trapped inside these parentheses. So we have two choices here. We can distribute the P, or we can actually divide the P. Dividing by P is going to make it much, much easier, I think. Let's go ahead and do that. So because P is being multiplied by all of the stuff in parentheses, there's a times here. What you can do is just divide both sides by P to get rid of it. And then this will cancel, and you're basically like freeing the V2 from the parentheses. So you're left with W over little p, and that's equal to V2 minus V1. Okay, we're looking for V2, so we're almost there. So we have this minus V1 here. So to get rid of that, again, we'll use the opposite operation, so addition. So plus V1, plus V1. These cancel, so we have W over P plus V1, and that's equal to V2. And that's pretty much it. However, most people um, write their answers on the left, like they write what they solve for on the left. Let's write it backwards. So V2 is equal to W over P plus V1. And that would be a perfectly acceptable answer. I hope this video has been helpful.